Of mine is kids who will be back out on their bikes or walking as we get back to school now and at the First Alert Safety Desk with Aisha and local police. They're out, they're educating us and they really want people to know to watch out for kids. Yeah, definitely top of mind. Very timely as the community grieves the loss of that little boy in Fond du Lac. But for this event, we've talked about Frogger mm -hmm. in the past and this one is dedicated to back to school, getting us ready for the school year. All of us, even if you don't have kids in school, this is good to know. In Brown County, you will notice very Various law enforcement stationed in different areas Alloway, Bellevue, Denmark, De Pere, Hobart, Howard, Green Bay, Pulaski, and Swamico. This is a partnership between local law enforcement and Wellow's Yield to Your Neighbor campaign. Officials will be using crosswalks just like that with officers standing by monitoring traffic, looking for people who are driving radically or speeding or not following th those rules to yield to pedestrians. And you will be stopped if you don't follow the law in that crosswalk. You may get a ticket or just a warning. That is up to the officer. Earlier this summer, the Frogger event resulted in over 100 warnings to drivers and over 860 vehicles that did correctly yield to pedestrians. But again, we want to keep it top of mind for all of us starting this week and next. So many kids are headed back to school. They are out there walking, biking, or waiting at the bus stop. It's important to keep a lookout for them so they can be safe going to and from school, guys.